What's your approach to the sale? The old way or the, the new way? You see, the time for systems of selling has passed. The time for sales manipulation has long passed. The time for finding the pain ended in 1972, and the time for closing the sale is gone, dead, and buried. And I wonder if you're using yesterday's approaches to complete sales. Many, if not most salespeople, not you of course, walk into a sale with product knowledge, a few questions, a sales pitch, and hope. This is a strategy that will result in how much is it? Price comparison, bad strategy. It's time for you to create an approach that works and wows, an approach based on value and differentiation, an approach that's personalized and customized. Problem is, this requires work, hard work. And in my experience, most salespeople aren't willing to do the hard work that it takes to make selling easy. They would rather do the easy work that makes selling hard. Salespeople are not willing to build reputation, build expertise, network, work longer hours, especially in these times, and prepare harder than the competition. Their social media presence is somewhere around zero. I have an approach that's different from yours. It's an approach that has evolved from years of selling and years of practice. And I'm current, internet current, Google ranking current, website current, social media current, and technology current. Here are my approach strategies and actions. I want you to see how many of them are yours. I've done my homework about their company. I've done my homework on the person I'm meeting with. I'm prepared with questions of engagement about them. I'm prepared with ideas in their favor. I'm more relaxed than formal. I'm confident, not cocky. I'm friendly, way more friendly than I am professional. My business card rocks. People comment when they get it. I give signed books, not brochures. I don't start until I've established rapport and found common ground. I ask more and talk less. I walk into the sales call with ideas and questions, not a pitch. I look for their pleasure, not their pain. I don't talk about what we do, I talk about how they win. And I ask for and get their Santa Claus list, what they're hoping to achieve, what they're hoping their outcome will be. I discover my customers' reasons and motives for buying. I answer with questions, not statements. I dare to inject humor, often, not jokes, humor. I don't make presentations from my laptop. If I use slides, it's from a projector. I'm prepared with slides if the meeting gets that far. If I use slides, they're fun, they're customized for the prospect, and they're not canned. I make my own slides. I often clarify a statement with a question before I answer. I discuss money openly, it's my favorite part. I listen with the intent to understand and then respond. I take notes to make certain that I remember what was said and what was promised. I do that to show respect, not just gather information. I use testimonials to prove points and create a buying atmosphere. I'm more patient than anxious. I wait for them to ask, then I tell. When I hear a buying signal, I ask for and confirm the sale. And I don't leave without asking for the sale or formalizing the next step. Let me give you some secrets. I have a reputation that's Googleable, and I have a presence on social media that anyone can find and be impressed with. My company answers the phone with a friendly human being on the second ring, 24 7 365. The hard work, internet presence. The hard work, business social media presence. The hard work, attraction through value. The hard work, earning and acquiring video testimonials. The hard work, Preparation for each and every prospect, personalized. The hard work, get up early, study, and write. The old way of selling doesn't work anymore. And the new way of selling is difficult for seasoned salespeople to master. This leaves a gap and, and an opportunity for anyone, but it takes hard work for everyone. Huge opportunity, you could be the one.